General Ed from Washington. Mr. Speaker, I rise today to call on us to work together quickly. We have an opportunity to accelerate the nation's recovery, create jobs, and reduce our deficit, but only if we're willing to do it together and take a balanced approach. Failing to do so will hurt millions of families and create unnecessary uncertainty for small businesses. We will be hurting families like Blaine and Jeannie Parks, whom I met with last weekend at their home in Redmond, Washington. Blaine is a truck driver, and Jeannie works at an elementary school. Blaine also owns a small fishing guide company. They told me how worried they are about higher taxes and cuts to programs they count on, like our schools. They work hard, pay their fair share, and for them, a tax hike would make it harder for them to make ends meet. It would hurt Blaine's business and prevent them from taking care of basic things like simple repairs to their home. I hope that the next time I see the Parks family, I'll be able to say that Congress came together, saved them from a tax hike, and got our economy back on track. I yield back.